With extreme temperatures hitting our area, many people are choosing to stay indoors. But what about those who do not have the option to stay inside, like firefighters working hard out in the sun, keeping the community safe? Fox 44's Mally Jones, she's in the control room with what you can do to help your local firefighters who are working hard in the sun. Mally. Yeah, Adam, well, volunteering and donating are huge, especially for those volunteer fire departments that are being hit hard by the economy. Jeff Wilhelm says the funding they get at volunteer fire departments is a small amount. With high gas prices and other rising costs, community support is huge so those men and women can effectively do their job. What you don't think about is when they get within 20 feet of that flame that's 10 feet tall that it's now up into the 160 range. And so their body's constantly sweating out all that water, all those electrolytes and all that other good stuff. He says water donations are helpful, of course, but so are electrolyte replacements and individually wrapped snacks. A little bit helps because that's less that they have to spend on that and more they can spend on fuel. Bosque County is ran entirely by volunteer fire departments. They have been thankful to receive the water and snacks they need, but what they need most is money and volunteers. These, these men and women that do this are just uh, they are truly the epitome of, of, of serving your community uh, selflessly. They are giving a lot of themselves. In many cases, they're paying for fuel and stuff themselves. They are taking off work and they don't get reimbursed for that necessarily. Volunteering doesn't have to mean fighting fires. Wilhelm says volunteer fire departments can use help at all times in all sorts of positions. The kind of help can do, doesn't matter if it's firefighting, doesn't matter if it's just driving a cooler to the scene, lifting up a, uh, an easy up shelter so they can get some, some shaded area. But they're looking for members to do all kinds of stuff, not just firefighting. Even if there's not a fire directly in your local fire department's area, they could still be sending resources resources or people to help out another fire. The fires are getting uh, more complex and uh, more volatile just about every day right now with the weather that we're having. On our website, you can find a link that will send you to a list that has the Venmo accounts for all of the volunteer fire departments in Bosque County. For other departments, you can reach out to their social media pages to figure out details on how to donate or volunteer. In the control room, Mally Jones, Fox 44 News.